Hello there, everybody. It's Rogue Legend here, and we are back with Hellpoint. Um, so I have some news. This character is currently level ninety, and I've gathered quite a bit more data. Quite a bit. Um, my current setup right now is this. I have a lot of things to show you. But first things first, I need to go get the things that are here. I've been playing with Jamer, who has bought this game for himself. And together we have cleared some stage, some, a lot of stuff in his game and discovered quite a bit as well. For example, do you see in the top left corner, I believe it is. The way you're watching it, it'll be in the top of the corner, yes. That actually, uh... Hello. It's just the way down? Oh. What? Dang it, not that! There was some more stuff I wanted to- I, I definitely wanted to show you guys some new stuff. Kinda like the little bonus video I did, but, you know, actual commentary and that's part of the series, but... Did not realize... There's some things here still. The light melee conductor recipe times one. A little bit late for that, but you know. But yeah, top left corner, um, while I go explore these new bits that I actually did not was not aware of, that actually can have things unlocked for you. So yeah. This light I'm using? Another thing that actually is super useful. Sorry, I, I see this stuff and I have to rub my face all over it. It's all against it. Yeah, I I've gotten a lot of things and I will be explaining as much as I can so that way you're all not in the dark here. But if the if the, the yellow circle is in the one of the two triangles on either side, right? Right or left. Enemies become, I believe, are slightly stronger and they have better chances to drop things. However... Oh, I thought something was behind there. There's also a case that... Well, there's a lot of things, right? Ah, so... I have just revealed that I've clearly gotten this and it has instead... Well, again, now I can just explain it to you, right? But there's quite a bit I actually missed previously. And don't worry, I've basically shown you all that there is to show in this area. Uh, the only thing of real importance is the two crafting benches that are here. And that's just in case you want an easier spot to go make all your good stuff. And, of course, easy death. Right, but now that I've shown off that, we're gonna go do the things that I know of first. And unfortunately, one of them I also can't show you because... It was so disappointing, and I'll explain why, like, once we get there. But we have to go all the way back to the embassy. Also, Jamer is entirely a mad lad who has decided, for some ungodly reason, to make the game harder. So we get squished. It's borderline frustrating, I'm not gonna lie. Oh dear, I have to... Okay, only four minutes. Got to double check the time. I also do remember that we have the other passport. But, um... Yeah, I discovered a lot. I had a lot of, uh... I think it's Gutex. I think it's Gutex who does the PogChamp on Twitch. I I've, I've had that face a lot this week. What's this? Oh yeah, Cyber Shield. Uh, you are a faker. I've gotten quite a few things maxed out. Um, you right there, Cape? All right. I fixed up some things, and I have some things to show you. Okay. 
So, first things first. Actually, I may have to die for this, but it might be worth it. Unless it's a thing that I can clear before this stuff happens. My favorite way to do this is to just legitimately go through what I call the shortage of shortcuts. It's a literal hop, break your ankles, attempt to skip on the broken ankles, cry a lot. I also don't know if this thing will now be permanently unlocked for me. If it is, I will again explain how this happened. But, ew. I know it made that noise and why, but it doesn't stop it from being gross. Let's go around. Ignore him. So. I will... Oh, okay. Yeah, you see how this is open? It is literally a timed event. The man who was in here previously explained it actually very nicely. He just flat out tells us... You know, hey, you didn't make it here in time. Okay, so that's another new thing we discovered. Hello, thank you on the channel. But yeah, what do you get in here, you might ask? Well, I will take a brief moment to show you. You get... Okay, there's not in here. One of these. A catalyst conductor. Which can upgrade any of the... Which can technically upgrade what I'm about to show you next. Now, I believe... Uh, it technically was... Actually, no, yeah. There, there's a shorter shortcut. Oh, I'm also going to show you what the this little light does that we got over there. I bet you're wondering how those hands got there. Wonder no more. To just legitimately quote the game itself... <clears throat> Omnicube Quantum Light, an unusual program that shines a specific wavelength of anti-photon to force unfazed matter to become visible to the naked eye. It became indispensable for interstellar travel once it was discovered that the universe was cluttered with unfazed matter, previously known as dark matter. So whenever you see a platform or you feel like there's supposed to be something there, chances are it's matter, especially if you're bumping into it. I wish I had known that. It would have saved me so much time. Because guess what? Remember how I told you all about that plus one healing thing? Yeah. Yeah. You, I could have gone... I could have grabbed that in an easier fashion. Okay, well, easier is very subjective, but, you know. A little angry at <laughs> that, if all... Being honest. No. No. Oh, uh, you freaking jerks. Whatever. I can do this now. So, again, Wave Jammer, I, the broken health suit that I showed off in the other episode, I actually was able to obtain and fix. And now that I have the full set, you'll notice that it says a little O2 in the corner there. I can now... Well, oh, it's just easier to show you all in all honesty. Ugh, you don't have to scream, though. Oh no, there's no oxygen! What am I- what do I do? Yeah! I can be out here as long as I want, and by the way... Yeah, we're Dark Matter stuff. Now, what I really want to show you all is something very important, and that is this. Not my skills. You all know I have none of those. Parkour! Overstepped! It's funny, I never fail that jump whenever I'm with Jamer or offline, but of course while I'm recording... Idiot. That is what I am. 
But I do have to show this. I, I can't just explain. It, it, it's when you die to something like that that you really, really badly just want to go, you know, I'll just tell you about it instead. But nope, I have to show it. I have to show it because I can't explain it. Yes, yeah, so we'll, be, we'll be grabbing a lot of stuff and doing a lot of things here. Uh, part of me does want to recruit Jamer for this. But A, I am concerned about the lag and how much there would be for both of us. Man, do you really gotta, like, be all up in my grow right now? You come chase me, I will kill you. And that goes for your buddy here, too. Shortcuts, parkour, excitement. Truthfully, with this, the spacesuit is actually some decent, like, heavy armor for you. So it's, uh, true, it's not a bad thing to wear just all the time, in all honesty. I mean, you know, if you're not looking like a spaceman. One per person. Mr. Fish, you could have had a long and you could have had a long life. You could have had a life filled with excitement and joy, but you chose to end it by messing with the bigger fish. Contemplate that for a bit. Okay. Anyway. Little jump. Well, actually, big jump, little jump. Probably little jump there. And... I did it again! Oh, but I landed on something that time. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with my brain. It did the same mistake twice. Don't worry, guys, my AI is just trying to look- I mean, I am learning! I, too, are human! Get the shield equipped. Oh, lord. I am- I am having a time right now. And it is not a fun one. I'm gonna kill you to make myself feel better. I feel better. Aw, uh, he don't feel so good. He gotta hug his shield. You know, he just came down with a bad case of dead. You know, maybe it is shorter to just go through here instead. Not have to deal with the friggin' jerks. Oh yeah, for anyone who's wondering, I have the, um, nano machines on. Because, hey, Fiddle Gear! Hey, hey, hey! Stop that knee. But it's way easier to get that back up. And the staff that I have actually has more leech on it. I believe it's 13. The highest that I think is currently amongst my weapons. Unless, you know, some of them have, like, better upgrades that I don't know about. I just feel the safest doing a, a run jump there. There we go. And actually, on here, you can just, whoo! And a big hop. Because I finally discovered what these light doors are. I almost didn't make it there, and I was going to be very upset. So, as you can see, there's a door of light up there. These hands say, over there is death. Over there, definitely death. But what they really mean is, up here... When the two circles are, it's it, it's it's hard to explain. But again, if you look at where my yellow circle is, when that yellow circle interacts with the the how do I describe this? Can I can, can my curse be? No, curse can't be on screen. Okay, I, I can use 
gestures or a message. When my circle is in the two circle area, the one that's connected to the lit right? Uh, the door opens. That makes sense. Um. Oh, oh, oh! Even, even easier. Boom! When the circle's in the circle, the door opens. Yeah, that, that's the that that that's the message I'm leaving. And in there is the last secret of this area, I believe. Because we've covered pretty much everything. We've gotten the healing proficiency. We got all the stuff that you could have wanted. We even got the stuff from down there in that small spot because now that you with the quantum with the quantum light, you can find everything. Literally everything. There's no secrets left in the embassy. And I'm actually very happy to be the one to report this to you. I'm also super pleased with the devs because of this. Last pre-synchronized. I know what you're thinking. Heroic, you just used the equivalent of the dark sign. Oh, did I? Did you? Did I? Did you? I mean, potentially, yeah. You know, I never did figure out exactly... Yeah, I still have all my souls. Uh, wait, why did I alt-tab? You know, whoopsie. Transport user, customs, not the bridge. Not there, not there. Here it was, the, the cabaret seller. So remember I pointed it out. No wait, I did need to alt tab so I could see the time. We still got some time left. Got a, got a nice eight minutes or so. Okay, we're back here again. Uh, let me go put back on my proper armor set. And boop. There we go. I believe it was back here? Nope, I'm going the wrong way. Should look around this place for secrets though. I may drag Jammer through here. First of all, you might see some of the funniest things ever on the Akari walkways. And I discovered a lot thanks to Jammer, because we went through this place together. You may actually see him in an upcoming episode because I may need help. I am not above admitting that. I do not think I would have been able to take on the doll dancer thing. Monstrosity. Without Jamer's help. Right? We're down here. I gotta... Roll over here. This guy's a jerk. Ugh. People, people have found ways to abuse this. Okay, just trick people. Sorry, man. I, gentlemen, I, I really don't wish to disturb you. Oh, there was a coin here. Uh, hey, friend, what are you doing? Fine, you got it. <laughs> Except for him. He did not get it. Ooh. I actually really do have to... I need to frickin' access the wall that this guy's blocking. It's a very specific thing you have to do. Yeah, I, I can't seem to access it. I'm actually gonna have to go back a little farther here. So, let's... Ugh. I really dislike that I have to do that.
But I can run. I can run all I want, and I cannot be stopped. We go back to the bridge. Take him to the bridge. I will not be denied my goodies. Nor will I be denied showing you guys new cool places, because technically we are done with that spot. I know I have the other place with the other freaking jerks. We're gonna shoot freaking fire tracking bombs at me. Make me angry and sad. But I ain't Jamer over for that, so we're all good here. Wee. Really am kind of irritated that I have to friggin' go all the way around and back because one guy thinks he's really clever. Okay, we're here. Never did see if I could open this now. Nope! Did not get the Ortega Tower stuff. Oh yeah. What am I doing? There we go. Problems solved with violence. Remember here? No, I wanted to do this. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's how I made it the first time. I didn't even realize it. What's that I hear you ask? But Heroic, how are you supposed to know that? You're not. You're supposed to advance the game and find out. I actually really should breach one of these. Oh, you absolute cheeky man. Wait, did you drop stuff? Yes, you did. Give me the juice. Uh, the question is, do I go ahead and do stuff or do I not? First off, I gotta clear out this area. Thankfully, because these guys are pretty easy on my world. I don't have to worry too much. Uh, his weapon is officially... Oh, never mind. It dropped with him. Yeah, that gate. Can only imagine how many people who were more observant were screaming at me. Unless there was actually nothing to do here, and I have misremembering. Might be that misremembering part. Oh, you tried to push me off. You you tried to fr you tried to patches me. You jerk game. Miss locations, locations, new stuff, secrets, hype. Well, here's some hype for you. But power of God. I love this weapon so much. It's so good. For me. Not necessarily for all of you. We I mean, may not even like it. We may think it's garbage and trash. And I really can't fight. Oh, you think real funny, Mr. Shooty Man. Well, I don't know why, but this video this game really does pull the whole hit weapons when an enemy uses it. Hit powerful, strong, wow. But when I use it. You know, that looks like a platform I can reach. <laughs> Everything in me is telling me don't do it. It's telling me to breach. Oh, and I should have breached!
Why am I so stupid? It was right there! I could have just... Oh my god. Where do I get my clown shoes and clown makeup? Oh wait, Jamer will literally murder me if I do that to him. So I think I'll avoid being murdered. For now. Never know when I might need it. Little back pocket, little ice in the hole. <sighs> Pardon? I did not mean to accidentally squeak through. But apparently I did. Alright, let's let's synchronize. Man, get out of my way. I have no time for you guys. Told you, no time. Actually, I really don't have any time. I'm going to have to end it here on the way back. So, I do hope you all understand, and I thank you for watching. It's a bit of a secret-esque slash spoiler filler episode. Ah, but something is coming up soon that I hope I'll be able to go back there in time and show you. Maybe. Uh, it seems like that clock is very set for certain areas in my world, but not for Jamers. I have to look more into that. But, of course, I will be happy to share any and all findings with you guys. And thank you all for watching. I do hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, you know what to do. I much appreciate you do. And that's what I just want to say. Laters.